Welcome to Flow Working, the Entrepreneur's Podcast. Before we begin, make sure to tap the subscribe button so you never miss out on any advice from one of our guests or regular experts. Over again. And it often doesn't feel like you're doing it. it, feels like it's happening to you. And the thing I, I found with people is, you know, most people get this. Human beings like to be right. Right? And I've seen people choose being right over being happy, over being healthy, over being wealthy, over having wonderful relationships. And whenever you're right, your brain gives you a hit of dopamine. And you love that. So it could be like, you know, my partners always cheat on me. And then you get into a relationship, your partner cheats on you consciously. You're like, oh my God, again. But underneath you're like, eh, I was right, right again. I get to be right. And, and, the crazy thing is you can get addicted to positive results and still get that dopamine hit, but people don't want to lose what they know works for them, right? And again, this is all going on unconsciously, but this works. This gets me my dopamine, got to, got to hit it, got to feel good about being right, because this is one of the few times I get to be right, because my life doesn't work right now and I've got all these problems, but here I get to be right. And that's, that's what happens with the addiction. Now, it's also a physical addiction, not just a chemical one, because every time a story plays out, you put more neurons in, a, in a, a cluster of neurons that hold that story. So you have more memories of it. You react to it more. You think it's going to happen in the future more. And so this cluster just grows. And in order to get out of it, you've got to start creating a new cluster of a different habit pattern, a different story, so that the cluster you're in starts to shrink and the new cluster grows. And most people don't take it to the level they're supposed to take it. So for instance, um, I look at it as a Jenga tower. Every belief pattern you have is a Jenga tower. You've got all these different towers. And when you want to change it, what you're doing is you're pulling blocks out of the Jenga tower. If you don't pull enough blocks or you don't pull the right blocks, then the tower never falls. So the addiction doesn't go away. But the thing is, when you start pulling blocks out, your life can actually change. So you think you've solved it. You think the tower is gone because you're getting the different results. But then because you're not maintaining it, the blocks start to go back in and more blocks get put on top. What is a great way that they could get connected with you right now to maybe get some more of their own shifting mindset to happen? You can go to energeticmagic.com, which is my main website. Or you can go to Shiraz Shifts, as in Shiraz Shifts Your Reality.com, which is, is just... That's the one if you just want to work with me, that's where you sign up the main web. Are you a business owner with tips of your own to share? Go to flowworking.net, that's F-L-O-W, working.net, to schedule your episode taping today.